I'm so happy. I'm so happy. It's the 30th. My surgery says so. I'm so happy. I'm, uh, I left my phone here so I could vote. And when I came back, I had the phone telling me my surgery is in a week. So it's October 30th. They're moving everything fast. I'm ready. I'm ready, 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 ready. They've got to mark me, and that's okay. They're going to do it all fast, really quickly. So they have everything as at the Civic. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Uh, I can't tell you how happy I am. I've now bawled a few times. I've been waiting for my colorectal surgery for, I think it's coming up on two years now. I was just actually talking to um, the constituency, uh, the office for liberals. And I was telling them how long. And I was talking about how today, how hope floats. And it was ironic because I am always with my phone. And today I was without my phone for a very short amount of time because I went to vote. And you can't take your phone in there with you. So I kept it in the car. And it, voting is just right down the street from me. So super easy. And when I got back to my car and got in and sat down, and I always look at my phone. So I got in and I sat down, looked at my phone, and I saw a hospital had phoned. And at first I thought, oh, okay, because when I, it, it's programmed under my gastroenterologist's name, but it could be anybody from the Ottawa hospitals. So I had um, basically uh, listened to it and as soon as I heard this is this person's name from the colorectal team I knew immediately and the next words were we have your surgery date and it's October 30th so we need to move fast because it's in a week and I I I was shaking I was looking for a pen I was looking for anything in my purse to write down the numbers so I could call them back to talk to them and so I, I was literally I was shaking I was shaking and I was crying you don't know what this means to me. You don't know what this means to me. And I found a pen and I started writing on this teeny weeny piece of paper. Literally teeny weeny paper. And I, um, Napa, it's okay. You're dragging your blanket over to see me? Wow. <laughs> Let's just stop the tears now. It's just how excited I am tears of excitement put it that way <laughs> when I was getting my here's the little teeny weeny paper that I was writing on tiny <laughs> anything that I could find that I could write on so I finally found the pen and I called her back and I left a message and I said it's me it's me and and said my name here's my number um yes 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 um i've been waiting for this please call me back here's my number i'm so excited i can't wait and so sure enough um i i got off the phone and let with the message 
and um, no sooner did I get off the phone in that that I was just seriously beside myself. I was like, did I actually hear that? And I started phoning some people that I absolutely love to tell them that my surgery is in a week. It's in a week. It's Wednesday. It's next Wednesday. It's next Wednesday. And so she phoned back and she said, hey, it's this person. And um, she said, uh, indeed, yes, it is in a week. And um, they're moving at breakneck speeds to get paperwork, to get everything done. She is uh, getting everything done and she will leave the paperwork with admissions tonight. And um, they will get in touch with me to either have me to come in as soon as possible um, and or they will do things um, as soon as I get there uh, next week when they call me to tell me when to come in. Um, I said, great, not a problem. I, I will be there with bells on. I'm about 10 minutes away from the hospital by car um, because it's at the Civic. And, uh, you know, I will be there. I will be there. I was so excited. She could hear it in my voice. Um, she said there was a cancellation and we put you in immediately. <sighs> I just spoke to my mom and, uh, because there was three people I called to let them know that this was happening. There was, um, my mom, because we've been traveling this journey now for a long time and she's been in hospital with me when... I've been there. Um, she's seen me at not great times because of this. And I called my... It's, it's amazing. Thank you when it comes... I mean, oh, you are such a beautiful soul that I love so very much. And no, you're right, like I told you, you don't have to be blood to be sisters. And I'm so looking forward to that bracelet, because that is going to stay on me. My sister from another mister. And I called her. And I was so excited. I was supposed to push something, but it didn't leave the message, so... She called me back, and I thought she knew, but she didn't. So I told her, and she was doing dances around just like I was. And I called my older son, and um, waiting to tell my younger one, but I called my older son to tell him because he's going to be looking after my home fires here, which is my Mr. P, and um, making sure everything's okay for Mr. P while I'm taking after taking care of myself and um, this is just going to be a journey a new journey for me everything new I don't want to cry again everything new they're happy tears just by the way they're not sad tears they're happy because I've been waiting so long. And it will change my life. For that part of me. It will. So, I'm going to call my, my family doctor tomorrow. Even though she's on sabbatical, I'm going to tell my, um, the doctor that's replacing her. I can't remember her name right now. Sorry about that. But I'm going to tell her that um, my surgery is going ahead. October 30th. And I told my pharmacist because they, we do my medications on a weekly basis. You know, I'm always there. I said, oh, his name is Steve. And he's so, so sweet. And I said, thanks for let me know. He says, oh, we're going to be stopping some medication for you. And I said, yep, I do believe we will indeed be stopping some meds for me. 
and uh, he said, I'm so happy for you. And he said, thank God, actually, you came to say something because we would have really been wondering what happened to you. And because you're in all the time. So, you know, you're not going to be in for a number of weeks now. And I said, I know. Um, it's just going to be a new life for me right now when it happens and I can't wait and I'm looking forward to it and I know the surgery is on the 30th which is a Wednesday that's cool so this is my weekend coming up <laughs> I'm gonna continue to do Misty and I have continued to do Misty to get my mind, my body, and everything ready for the for this day, for this moment. I've wanted to continue. I wanted to do things for myself to get me ready for this moment that's coming. And I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm more than ready. So when I do Misty tonight, when I do something with Misty tonight, love set me free. You betcha I'm going to shake my tail feathers. And as she would say, shake your ass and tatas. That's going to be shaken too. So again, thank you for everyone. Everybody that was praying for me everyone that was pulling for me everybody who that's been sending up vibes positive vibes every single thing that they've been sending up it worked it does work so keep doing that for people that you care about because it works I'm proof of that I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. I'm about to lose control, and I think I like it. Yeah, yeah. I'm so excited. My surgery is October 30th. I'm about to lose control, and I think I like it. I seriously, I am. I, I, wow. I was in voting. Voting. And you can't bring your phone in when you're voting. When I came out, there was a message from the hospital. And um, it could be anybody when it says one name that comes up. So I called, and it was the colorectal team. And I knew immediately uh, that they said uh, they had a surgical date of October 30th in a week. And I was... And they wanted me to call back because there's a lot of things that need to be done. I'm so, so, so excited. And I want to thank every single one of you for your prayers, for your positive. For your positive vibes, for your positive thoughts, for your energy, for every single thing you've sent up for me over this long while waiting, over this long time waiting game that we've played thank you so much for everything that you've done thank you these are happy tears because you've been with me waiting and now it's gonna it's just around the corner it's just around the corner we're almost there here we go. I don't know what this is. Here we go. Oh. 
How do they do it? Where do they find all that energy? Always seeing the inexhaustible store of pep and ginger. We're gonna go. Pose and walk. Two poses. Pose, pose, and walk. But come on, sass it up. And you sass it up by sticking stuff out. Yes. Keep going. And if you have furniture at home, you can pose with your furniture. Yes. Perfect. Now, little butt. Stick your butt out and do a little dance. You can travel it, you can keep it in one place. I like to look at mine every now and then. Now get ready, you're gonna bend your knees and you're gonna pump your hip. Now push it forward, really push it forward. Now you're gonna wobble. So you're gonna give me six hips and a wobble. Yes. Yeah, attitude. Now a weird wobble. Can't get it wrong. But give me some attitude here. Let me see your wobble. Pump it. Come on, get down in it. Make your body work. Wobble. Come on, get those hips in it. Wobble. Now hold it here and just melt. As low as you can go for your own body. Slowly bring it up. And walk. Again. I know you can give me more attitude. If you're not confident, just act like it. And again, you just stick stuff out. You can pose with your friends. But, 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 but. Do little things with your butt. You can even move with it. Now, are you ready? Give me those hips. Yes. Now, a weird wobble. And it's more fun the more weird you are. Watch this. Yeah. Do it. Wobble. <laughs> Have fun with your body. Now on this one, more arms. Yeah, baby. Hold it here and melt all the... All the way. Don't stop. That was awesome! Yeah! <laughs> All right. All right. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. Oh, I can see all obstacles in my way. Gone are the dark clouds that had me blind. It's going to be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. Gonna be a bright, 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 sunshiny day. Oh, yes, I can make it now. The pain is gone. And all of the bad feelings have disappeared. It was that rainbow I've been praying for. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. Look all around, nothing but blue skies. 
Look straight ahead, nothing but blue stars. Well, I can see clearly now the rain. I can see all obstacles in my way Here is that rainbow I've been praying for It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. And it certainly is going to be a bright, sunshiny day, because I can see clearly now. We're going to just heel drop. Just give me a strong heel drop. Heel drop. Let your body be loose and relax. And when you hear that clap, connect to it. But keep your heels heavy. Now I want you to take this clap and I want you to start to play with taking it all over your body. And let your hands be a little heavy and really get some stimulation in that body. But again, don't stop dancing it. All around. Get your body moving all directions, all levels. Here we go. Now you're going to go down and down. Down. Now I really want you to use your legs here. Bend down into it. Yeah. Dip into it. Now at the same time, make your arms do some really cool tribal type movements. Yes. Yeah, give me some hot in there. Yeah, baby. Use your legs. You gotta bend them. Now here we go. Do it again. At home, let me hear ya. Hold it here and you're gonna go. Be healed. Let your arms be heavy, let your body be heavy. So think about draining that lymphatic system. And when you hear that clap, connect it to your body. And then create your own clap dance.
go, what? Who? What? Who? Yeah, what? Who? One more. Who? Give me a ooh wee. So we, like she says, bring hands up to your head and we think the thoughts that we need, we speak the thoughts and it comes from our heart. I'm sending all that love to you because we're on the right track, yes we are.